Hello guys, then again. So we are back at our Sutropolis and as you can see for our Chinese pangol I've changed it a lot. So the square box is gone. So it's not really optimal yet, but the animal feels pretty happy. So let's move to the next enclosure just to draw in more people. So this is how it looks now. And over here, we gonna put down the common warthog just to draw in a little bit more people. Doesn't need that much space. So space wise, it needs 360 square meters for a maximum number of seven warthogs. So let's see what we can do. And again, um, we will try to work without barriers. As you can see here, everything is, is a natural enclosure except for this part because the Chinese pangog can swim and this is enough to let him escape so that's why that little fence is here so after the warthogs we already have our um, zoo keepers around the corner so let's build a gate like this then we go with a invisible fence. First, a small piece so I can hide it within the walls. And again, draw it back into the walls. And then a little bit over the waterline. in the water please so and then up here it down so this area is now good for 1612 so that is nearly five times the size it needs but we are gonna place a lot of stuff in here so I already bought the warthogs so let's play or at least I thought I did yeah, 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 here they are. Female and a male. So let's first close off the barrier a little bit to make it a little bit more natural. So let's work the terrain because we don't like the sharp edges for a natural look. And then from here, we're gonna higher up this part of the mountain all the way up to the gate it doesn't go further than that so we will clean that up with the rock work so. so how many times did you guys try uh, a franchise mouse and being successful at or successful at it or being frustrated on the end because it failed anyway please let me know in the comments uh, what is the best way I think I will use the rock work straight away from here so after the rocks let's remove these And then we will kick off with these ones first. So, just to hide the invisible line.
possibly the work works like the water, but we will see soon enough the moment we will let them up. Then we have a rock out here to close off the area. And by the way, I've got a extra person playing with me, my wife. She gives me some little tips and hints. So if you hear a voice in the background, then it's my lovely lady in life. Hi guys. <laughs> a little bit too shy. Also for her the first time being on YouTube. So. And from here we can maybe push it a little bit further. So let's build another one like this. Place this one first because I don't like this. And this goes away. You. Go here. And the terrain doesn't work. Okay. the door. Then let's move it in. If the door wants to move that close. No. No? I don't think so. Let's remove the door then. Then let's try to position it again. And pathway is too close as well. So cleaner needs to move. Sure. And of course everybody is traveling around. You know what? They have to wait for a bit. Just pause it for one second. Place the door again. this down as well as part of the building. We can also give them a hard shelter immediately, plus I'm done with that dead angle. Then copy this roof. Let's move it over. Like so. Just to make it a little bit more easy, remove the roofs. So. Here we are. And put them back on. And then here we have our nice hard 
provide shelter for the warthog. Close down so that is nice. Just place one rock to be sure. Nature. Then I'm going for the large rock. Just place it in. Change it a little bit. So, all right, let's bring in the warthog to see what they are gonna do. So first, this one, put them in quarantine. Yeah, we don't want sick animals. No, we definitely don't want sick animals. Although, I've researched them already and I wonder once research if they get sick at all. Prep up Keep some sleeping place and water, food. Uh, let's see, a mid size would be fine. Like so. Money is still going up, as you can see. For just that one en enclosure out here, it draws enough people to make a small profit, including the shops. Oh, let's. Push it on play, otherwise my warthog won't be quarantined in a long while. And my mechanic. I, let's reconnect the road. So, so, that is pretty straight up, nice, so then the vet and the mechanic can do their job. We got a visitor, Mr. Burns, so let's say hi to them. And I've got a transit uh, warning. And the reason why is because I use these to make the bridges like this. So they go on a really long slope, nice and easy, nice and smooth. And this is what I've learned from my sheets to make it a little bit more vibrant, natural, without climbing hills on each corner. Let me remove this one, it doesn't belong here. So, the moment this enclosure is done, we need to fill in those shops. So, I'm gonna place them around here, and because we're gonna bend off the circle wise, like I told, we're gonna build a shop area here as well. Quarantine is done, so let's move them over. Time I can clean up this wall a little bit. So they will escape now from every angle the moment they get in. Just let me close this one up before they arrive. game for a sec and we need to assign a new um, cleaner for this uh, habitat so Keep let's see can those guys swim 
Uh, this is how I check that. And they can escape all over the place, so that's gonna be nice. So probably for the one fencing I'm gonna use over the waterline is this one. So let me use this one to draw in the fencing. Here we go. So that one is closed off. Then here we need some rock work to keep them contained. And let's see, pull them in, turn them around, push forwards like so. This one can be sunken into the ground. There's not one stack of rocks. Like here. Mm, we need a couple big rocks to just close this down. Like so. Turn it around, sink it in. Well, I've got two of them. Here we are. So, let's let them run for a small bit to recalculate, here we go, and what about now, and they are contained, that is really nice, nice and quick, then we're going to place one big rock here, flip it around so that it can hug the building for a bit. can make it a little bit more nice for them so they already have their bedding let's give them food and water first of all let's assign uh, a guy that takes care of them new work area this is this one and this one and the feeder this will be the Warthog. Here we go. Let's assign this one to it. And then this mechanic can also maintain this enclosure, including the vet. All right. So let's place some food and water down. Where are you? Let's first get the work, work hook. 
of in the Dutch saying gewoon knobbelswijn. Again, close to the entry, so I can let them fly all over the exhibit. And then some water. And that would be in this corner. So that one is done. So let's play. And then let's see on how their needs are. Terrain, paint it. They want to have more short grass and soil and rock. So, first, let me paint everything for short grass. So, at least everything is now green. And then we're going to make it more nice at the moment. We place down the enrichment items. So let's do that. Food enrichment. Here we are again. The big puddle in front for the people so they can see it. And here we go. This one is also nice. If we place it then in this corner. it now. They still need toys, so let's place some toys down. So, so I know I will place down the right one, so this one was wrong. Let's remove that one again. Let's put down the barrel, turn it around, here we go, some toys to play with, a scrubber, and a sprinkler, right about here. And they are fine, so now there's more the environment we're going to change, so let's make some hills to make the exhibit a little bit more attractive. Like this, then smooth it out. On this side we can leave it. I like some rock works on one side. Let's smooth this one out. Watch out by escaping. No, I don't think they can jump that far, but let's check. Nope, That's still close. safe. Just in case, let me remove this one. Or this, this little bit. Like so. Then we take the rock work again. Again, we start with a large one, so the biggest climb is around here. So let's drop it down. Like so, a little bit up, tilt it a little bit. Like so. Turn it around. Like so. Then we take this one. No. This one. Tilt it a little bit, so it feels like more like a small hill. And then we're going to do the same. Flip it around, sink it in. 
and a little bit to this side, like so. Then we have a nice rocky edge, I believe. And yeah, nice. Yeah. Then for the last one to finish it off, like some plants. Now then, I will start after I'm done with this rock. No. And then here we go. Looks really nice. Maybe we can do a small bit here as well. Now, as we used European trees, like this one, the S, I will continue this uh, growth all over the exhibits. To unify it all together. Now let's see if the warthog have the same idea about that, before I say that. Uh, they are... Uh, this one... Don't think that's gonna work, but let's see. Continent will be Africa. Biomes will be... Grassland and Tropics. And then let's see if the S is still in. No. 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 That's a pity. Then we have to look for something similar. That's really too high. Cute little trees, but not the one I'm looking for. Here, to look at the Chinese thing too. Oh, and we got a small pango coming up. That's nice. Also for their food. What's wrong with their food? Let's see. I saw that they say it's too little. No. Where are you? Here's one. So what are you saying? He's, he's still happy. Yeah. But what are they saying? They say something about the food. Mm. Well, this one. Uh -huh. Oh, this is the last one from the old exhibit. So that one is gone. <laughs> um, let's see. Just smooth it out a little bit more. Like so. And is auto paint on? Why do I get long grass all the time? Then it automatically gives me long grass. Alright, nice. Let's remove that again. Like so. I don't like that much tall grass. Trees. <coughs> Sorry about that. Uh, trees, trees, like this oh. is a nice tree, nice and green. So, does it fit with this one? Yeah, fine by me. So let's place one here, then tilt it a little bit. So, then we place another one, uh, that's too much, otherwise the people can't see them, although they can also work a little bit further be before they can just the whole road, like uh, so, then tilt it again, and then let's take another one on the same position, but let's pull it back. Push it around a little bit, and then let's tilt it the other way, like so. It shouldn't be too far, and maybe a little bit more in, like so. Just push up the train a little bit to hide the roots, like so. As it is in the shades. We give it a little bit of soil, like so. And then we want to have another one. How much? We're gonna get a baby. 
Hey, small warthog coming up. Let's see, how much do they like? That's not much, so I have to, to be careful with the trees, otherwise it will be an empty enclosure. Uh, then again, I can push them around a little bit, like so, and then one here. And I think one here would be nice, tilt it a little bit towards the road. So, then smaller green, uh, what do we have, bananas, bananas, plants that sting you the moment you walk through them, a gustard apple tree, no, that's not what I'm looking for, maybe the elephant ears. Elephant ears. Yeah, but it doesn't. Yeah, maybe maybe it does. But let's see. Maybe aside the rock work. Yeah. Like so. One here. Happy Warthox! They've got food! Yay! So. Mm. Like so. And uh, some waterline plants. So hide the fence a little bit. Like so. A little bit. Like so. Sides, place it down, move it onto the waterline, sink it down a little bit. Then how much still to fill up? Already in the green, but still have space to do something with it. Uh, we don't want to create a autumn, so I will stick with the green. I think this looks nice together. Also have to clean up this hard edge. Mm. Maybe there are the rocks. Maybe push it away in between, like so. And then one like so. And then like. Why is it one? Yeah. And then another one. Then let's see if we can fix this sharp edge again with rock work to begin with this because this will fit nicely like so little, turn this around push it up and, and does it fit let's sink it in Push it down a little bit, like so. They seems to be happy. 
because they're running and playing around. They have no sorrows, they just have a clean space to run at. They got food, they got everything they need. Just small kids. <laughs> the moment they are hungry, they, they, they start to scream. Mommy, daddy, <laughs> I want something to eat. So let's take a big one again. Let's slide it right in. Lower it down a little bit so it is equal with the main ground. Tilt it a little bit. Like so. Merge it in together. Then out here we can use the brush as well. Uh, rough rock. Like so. Just a different. Ah, here we go. Like so. You're still happy because I took away some grass from you. Where are you? Sleeping. Watching the mechanics fixing the fence. That's nice. Now, also a small a small trick uh, Rudy Ren uh, Camel gave me, or at least gave the whole YouTube uh, community. If you use the walls from the building, they don't have maintenance cost. So he is just fixing a invi invisible wall. So I would consider he's only fixing the door because it's jamming up. There are still no people. There are still no people because maybe they are not attracted yet. And otherwise, let's draw them in here. Mm. Why are you not coming? Maybe Some information. Maybe they come if they heard something. Maybe I can place a little plateau for them so they can look up close let's hire it up with a couple of meters see if the game lets me that's too much let's go by a meter let's go up with two little stairs and then flatten out I want to have this as a wood piece So, and that doesn't work, okay, then we're going to do it differently, let's find it out, like so. Then let's fix it up with some pillars. Exactly like this. Then one here and one here. Here we go. Maybe a fence so they don't fall in. People are not coming yet, so oh, why are they not coming? Why do people refuse to come? What's the problem? Well, maybe they come now. They are walking. Well, let's see if they cross the bridge or that they are afraid of my new bridge. Keep on walking. Shoo. 
Oh, you're learning. That, that's also nice. And they go the wrong way. Why are they going the wrong way? Hmm. Alright. Well. Let's see if we can connect it on a different way then. Still, let's complete this. Uh, building. I think you have a small one there. And that would be this one. Like so. A little bit more in, if possible. But yeah, that's it. so. Nice and smooth, like so. And let's support this as well. And we have the small one too. Now hopefully people won't trip over that, that small edge, but... Let's copy these over, like so. And then again, to finish it off, like so. You have two babies, I think. Look, two or three. Ah, uh, they've multiplied already. That's nice. How is my tangle going, by the way, before they start fighting? Small lady again. That is nice. These are already in the trade centers of Springs. This one. Uh -oh, there is one escaped. Why? One war on Wardog. Why a small one? Because they can fit into tiny. Ah, yeah. oh, they just usually dead end. Such annoying. All right. Then we need to push in. This a little bit further, like that. So, because the animals like to keep me busy. Where's the small, small one? Just to double check if they can cross rocks or something. They're playing hide and seek. Next thing here. is, yeah, here is one. Don't run away. Stay here. Yeah. Like. This is all closed, this is all closed, so Inside look, also now. Looks all fine, no red signals, so alright. Um and Stark again. We are completing this this one now. Why is it on a strange angle? This is better. So like so and then I need to figure out why the people are ain't coming. <laughs> Strange, by the way. Maybe I can push this up as well. Then with a smaller one, like so. Then like so over the corners. That's nice. On this corner. So, oh, now we have to close it off, so what is nice, what is nice, maybe some rope, then I need to look for everything, yeah, I think that this will be nice, mm -hmm. let's, let's drop it. Yay! Yay! First people! <laughs> finally, they found it! Find the, the, the hidden treasures! Usually they spam the, the place immediately with, with a new animal. No, they didn't. Yeah, that looks nice. Like so? Yeah, they found it! 
Now you have to do some information next to. So, well, first their safety, then next I want to have their money, and then I will educate them. <laughs> you don't want the money first? Maybe an extra pillar in the middle because this is really too long for a rope. Like so. And there we go. Nice. Then we use this one again. Like so. Yeah. Like so. And then we need. Here as well. Yeah. And swing it around. Perfect. Then I need this again. This one to place it on the other side, like so. Here you have one. And then we have these because it should be all equal, like so. All right. First, maybe that's a little bit too. Yeah. Like so. Maybe a little bit further so I can. Draw it down a little bit, like so, and so. Build a wooden pillar again. I think that you know two meters should be long enough just to hit the ground, like so, and then do it like this as well. To make it a little bit more easy. Yay! And they collide already. Really nice. Like doing grocery shopping where people don't let you through. Corona. Where everybody is frustrated, like, I want to get out. Alright, let's copy these ropes. I really like rocks, but not at this moment. Like so. And I see we already filmed quite some time already. So let's see if I can wrap it up before everybody falls asleep. Like so. And I. No, I don't like that. Like so. time on this side and we have a floating rope all right why is that because you missed one then like so that's awfully close to the edge and let's place another one like so so yeah. Here we go. Then let's play some donation bins. No, not trash bins as well. But first, I'm gonna place these in these corners. Let's see where can they see them. Here they just walk. Maybe yeah. Here, just give me some. Maybe on the end. And on this corner, probably they will stand on the bridge later on here as well. So let's put one here then the education so here we go screen turn it around I don't want to block their view so let's place this one by the tree so 
this is one. Then here as well, I don't want to block the view, so let's place it here in the corner. Snapping off. Uh oh, right. sick animal. We had them in quarantine, right? And yeah. And still they get sick. That's funny. They say there is a sick animal. It's one of the youngsters. Alright. Well. What? You have a present also. First, let me hide this one here. Should be fine enough that people can't break it by kicking against it and Warthog can't reach it because it's too high. But still can hear it. Like so. Warthog. And let's see. Like so. Yeah. Now let's start with 2 2. Then we need bins. Again, people like just to throw stuff away the moment they keep it longer in their hands than one minute. Like here we go. Bins. Then one here, one here, by the tree, because we want to keep it green. The other side of the tree, here, and this side as well. They oh. are a lot on this side, I thought. Now here we already have the bins. Alright, so now we need the benches. Uh, I think you need the classic one. Classic Europeans. Let's see if it can fit one, by the way, because it's all... Yeah. And here we can place two, if I'm lucky. Yay. Alright. But I don't want them... On... Uh, they need to place it on the roads. That's not good. I think you have to buy another one. They are. They don't have to go on. Mm. Let's see if they fit here. No, because I want to have nice slopes. It doesn't allow me to place benches. That's really nice. We talk about a slope of three degrees. Come on, people. They want if you go on the path. Ah, here they want. Here it is allowed, okay. So out here we can push it up with bushes and all, rock work. But for now, it still looks empty. This doesn't look nice yet. We have to fix this one up. But hey, we have the second animal in our group. Let's see if we still make profit. We're still in the 2000, so it's not that much, but it's all in the plus. Let's see if we can hire another cleaner. Hey, yeah. we oh. have an inbreed. Let's stop that. Stop that. Stop that right now. But that's daddy. Then daddy goes away. Bye bye. You know for sure because you only has brothers in it. Mm, no, I don't think so. Uh, let's see. Yeah. Then I need to buy another one. All right. I thought I had. No, you had no a new females, but no new males. <laughs> All right. Then let's buy a new one. Please give me a white one. And now we have all females. That's not good. Uh, uh, maybe Mama goes out and two new females go in. Uh, I can let Mama in, but I can give her under anti conception. Yeah, let's do that. We put one of the new ladies back in. Like uh, this one. And we have protests. Why do we have protests? Why doesn't it move? Quarantine one of the ladies, and then one of the males. Let's stay this one. 
I just took him out, or he was already in. I don't know, let's put this one in. Here we go. And... Ooh. Look out for Sissy. Well, I want to know where the protests are for. They have everything they need. Where are you going? What's the problem? Food. Quality. Trace highest velocity. Huh? Water is good enough? No, we don't have water. That's why. Alright. And the roof isn't finished either. Can we extend? No, because then we kick out some negative influence. And uh, maybe out here? That would fit nice. Is there a road behind here? Yeah, there is. So if I kick out this one, yay. Then facility water just saves on a small spot if it is willing to fit. Like so. Why it doesn't fit? Why it doesn't. Yeah. Like so. And here we go. And then let's grab this one. Close it up again, like so. Nice. Let's finish up the roof because this isn't nice. No, it's not. But that explains why the animals were getting sick yeah. not that long ago. Like so. Yay, fresh water, they are already running for their reservoirs. Like so. And then let's close it down. Like so. And everything is fine again. Uh, if you go for the Chinese one, look for Sissy. That they don't can read or uh, do entailed or something like that. I don't know how you call it. Yeah, give mother the end conception. Thank you. Uh, uh, the 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 CC also, not only mother. Let's see here. For now, we only have mother. This one is in the exhibit, so you will get the anti-conception, quarantine, quarantine, so these need to be finishing up. Then let's name this, it's also handy. Uh, handle, exhibit. Not gonna disturb you any longer so see you next time thank you